all right guys welcome back so we're doing something a little bit different today we are out pond fishing i don't think you guys have ever seen me on this channel pond fish i think that's correct but anyway today we're out here this pond only opens up like five times a year so these fish are not pressured this is one of those days and we're gonna try to catch some fish on giant swim baits i don't know if you can see that i've got a gantrell junior tied on and a um storm arashi glide so oh we're gonna try to catch some big old bass on the glide bait there's a 10 pounder in one of these ponds i have 100 percent confirmed proof about that and man you can see them busting before we even get to the pond so we're gonna start fishing about to put y'all on the chest and we'll see y'all in just a second so we're at our first pond spot here man there is beds everywhere around here it's just little tiny fish on these beds but they're for sure Oh, there's a bigger one right there. There for sure are fish on these beds. All over them, in fact. And there's a drain right here, so I'm gonna take this big swim bait. We'll make a couple casts around this drain. See if I can pick up a couple fish. So what I'm starting out throwing, this right here is a Jackal Gantrell Jr. It's a three segmented swim bait. It's kind of a crazy color. It's not super natural, but it's okay. I'm still gonna throw it around for a little bit. We're going to a new pond. That pond was too shallow. It was like a foot deep everywhere and we could see bass. They were all on bed. It's just, it was like a foot deep and there was grass. So we were getting caught up in the grass and we weren't able to fish it right. This pond right here I'm hoping is a little bit better. So one thing when you're pond fishing, you always want to stop before you get all the way to the bank and make a couple casts. That way you don't spook any fish off. Two pounds. Oh my word, Thomas. That's a 10 pounder, dude. Oh my word. Dude, I just missed a 10 pounder. Like, do not move. Do not move. Oh my word, I just missed a 10 pounder. Look, you see all that dust you stirred out? Dude, that was, a, that was seriously the biggest fish in my life. Dude, oh my word. Dude, I missed that fish twice. That's a 10 pounder, dude. Felt like I set the hook into the ground. Get this up under this bridge here. Just start pulling it through. It was over there. Cause he, I watched him swim off. Like I, I saw him sitting there. And I, at first I didn't think it was a bass. And then all of a sudden I looked. And I swim my swim bait by it. Yep. Ooh. Well, fish number one. Just swimming this jig along. Wasn't even expecting to catch one there. No, but it's okay. There's no under the bridge. Number two, back to back. Little fish. So we can get you third. This jig officially has no crawl pinchers. Still gonna catch one. I was swimming that jig when he ate it just a second ago. caught this fish as soon as we started swimming it as soon as we started swimming it the jig caught him skinny thing then it's real you want to see the fish you want to see the fish yeah here you want to touch the fish all right i'm gonna let him go it's swimming away Oh, he came off. 
that's him. He's not big, but it's a fish on a bed, and that was amazing. He, um, I was trying to catch him on this jig right here, but as you can tell, that's a little bit big for his little tiny mouth. So we switched up to this little creature bait. He got it good. Little tiny fish. We're gonna let him go back to his bed. I hope y'all were able to see the under, underwater footage I was filming. So we'll see how good it is. If it's not very good, I'm not gonna put it in the video. See you, buddy. Come. Good looking one there. Bass number four, five, something like that. They're all tiny. We're still waiting for one of these big ones. But pretty fish. Hey, bud. Just caught him on this little trader bait with a rage crawl trailer. Keep fishing. Sightfish that one. It's the biggest one of the day for sure. Two and a half. All day long. Two and a half. Well, maybe not two and a half. He's at least two though. Looked a whole lot bigger. Oh, I just missed one. Crap. He ate it right at the bank. I didn't get a good hook set on that thing. There he is. Oh, I missed him again, dude. That's twice I've missed him. They're all skinny, skinny as a rail. Good grief. That is crazy. It's another one on the chatterbait. Guys, I'm, I hope you're enjoying the content. I'm trying to switch it up just a little bit and do some pond fishing. Do some other stuff because, I mean, I'm, fishing on the river gets kind of boring after a while. Just trying to change things up and make some cool videos for you guys. I've got one last cast, dude. Oh, he came off. No. <sighs> All right, guys. So we're officially done fishing. I don't remember how many we caught. We caught a bunch. We missed a bunch. Oh, my word. This chatterbait was just the hookup ratio. It was horrible. We're about to put the rods in the car. Hopefully, we'll get some Chick-fil-A or something. And um, we'll see you guys next time.